Hello, welcome to this little Belgium vlog thing. Great. <laughs> I am currently in the car, as you, can, as you can see, we're in the car. And we are at Dover. We kind of made all the way to Dover. We left at seven o'clock this morning to make our way to Dover. And we are getting the ferry to Dunkirk, which I'm kind of like, oh my God, Harry Styles was there. But at the same time, I'm like, at ah, cool. So yeah, we're getting the ferry from Dover to Dunkirk and then mum is going to drive us all the way to Belgium. Today we are off to Bruges. So yeah, we've got a fun little week planned. I'll give you a rundown of what we're doing. Um, you'll kind of see as we go along, but we're going to Bruges for a couple of days. Then we're going off to a theme park in the Netherlands called Efteling. It's an amazing theme park, oh my God. And then we're going for two days to a place called Eep, which... Um, is where they do a lot of, they've got a lot of World War One memorials and things like that. So that's what we, that's what the kind of the gist of the holiday is. Yeah, so I thought I'd bring you along, have a little uh, watch of what I get up to on my little holly bobs. Hopefully this is going to be an exciting one. I'm really looking forward to going to Effling on Saturday. So excited. But yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. It's going to be a good week and uh, it's just me and my mum and we're driving everywhere we've taken the car uh, she's just getting some fuel at the moment but yeah we're about to well we're not about to get on the ferry we've got another about an hour and a half before we have to get on the ferry so <laughs> look out here she comes the woman that I love Too bad she'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing How I feel for her she won't feel the same for me I've got this picture in my mind It's just the two of us Just the two of us But I know I'll have to try Try to let her go Because she won't be mine I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's given me these feelings that I've never felt before But she will never know that I love her so well She's with somebody else and I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know, na na Never know, na na Like she stole my heart Without knowing she did But I guess that it will pass Yeah, I can't be the only one Who got lost inside the blue of those eyes I've gotta let her go I know it won't be easy I wanna hold her close I'm in the car still because mum's just trying to find the hotel. Well, we found the hotel, but mum is just going to go in and find out where we park in the car. And so I'm sat here, so no one gives us a parking ticket. We, I don't know if I told you, but we went into Calais. No, we went into Dunkirk for um, our ferry. And I was trying to spot the, the pier that they used in the film Dunkirk. And then I did research and i was absolutely gutted about what i found because it, the pier was reconstructed they didn't so they actually they made it for the film and took it down so i'm gutted by that because um i wanted to go see it so um didn't do any film spot in there film location spotting because it's non-existent now so that's that's a bit annoying isn't it 
anyway yeah so we're just just gonna go into the hotel really I, we haven't really got much planned for tonight probably just relax a little bit we're a bit tired um yeah relax chill out find somewhere to get some food because tomorrow is the proper day of exploring bruges tomorrow is the proper day today we're just going to relax a little bit been a long old morning because it's now currently half past four here in bruges so it'll be half past three at home and we've been on the road since seven o'clock this morning uk time so that's eight o'clock here so that's ages <laughs> okay so we're in our room in bruges can't remember what the hotel's called i'll tell you in a second but this is what you see when you come in the door there's our one of that's my suitcase um yeah so we'll start here got a door here this takes you into the i'm going to call it the toilet room because it's a room toilet sink we just put the towel in there and yeah, fairly fairly decent i mean it's a toilet what do you expect this is the door to the outside world got a uh, some wardrobe space da -da. then closes up you can come around through this little like hallway type thing and this is the room not I'm, i don't know what how i feel about this wallpaper but yeah a chair got two single beds which is great because it's me and my mum got a little desk situation there so much put your suitcase on you've got tv two little bedside lights no bedside table this side but there is a stool which i have chosen as my bedside table and then in this glass room here come out come in i mean stool another sink nice great big mirror which is great hi and a little one there hello and you've got a shower we've got a little little uh garden outside see here you go oh <laughs> lol <laughs> yeah that's our room i've nicknamed this one my bed well not nicknamed this is my bed i've decided and then this is the window that's gonna be next to my bed it's the same garden but it's just a little bit different so we're here two nights it'll do it's fairly cheap um the hotel is called mon 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 that's the hotel <laughs> What I've just noticed is you get two wine glasses, so uh, go buy your wine and bring it here and you'll be great. But yeah, I'm not, I don't think I'm feeling this wallpaper to be honest. It's a bit old school, isn't it? But it's alright, it'll do. <laughs> Girl, the fields were mine We played hide and seek for hours Raised our shadows among the pines So offshore, playful and free Without a care in the world I was one rich little girl Daydreamer, kidnap me Take me back all the way back to them days Running around In a gown and a crown Barefoot No mistake ever kept me Summers catching fireflies and winters on our skates. One big smile across my face. We used to dance our way to church on Sundays. Mama set the pace. Daydream of working and me.
because we're in a potato museum <laughs> learning about chips photo now. <laughs> Hello. So 
So we are now actually in the Netherlands. We are going to Efteling tomorrow. So this morning we left Bruges. We went to go see a church which had a Michelangelo statue in. Apparently Michelangelo is a very insane artist. And it's the only like statue outside of Italy. So we went and see, saw that. Then we went on to Ghent. Yeah, Ghent was all right. It's kind of like a Bruges, but bigger. Much like amazing if you're a student or something because there's lots to do, lots of shopping, things like that. But for me, I preferred Bruges. Anyway, we're now in the Netherlands because tomorrow we're going to Efteling, which is a theme park here in the Netherlands. Apparently not very many people, tourists, know about it, but it is amazing, so good, so good. I've been twice before, tomorrow will be my third visit. Um, but yeah, I thought we'd give you a hotel room tour. We're in a nearby hotel to Effling. I think um, it's called Hotel Wow, Wow Woodrick. Yep. But it's quite a decent room size. We have a two nights here tonight, Evelyn tomorrow, and staying that night, tomorrow night, um, and then we're going to be moving on to Ypres in Belgium. So we're just here kind of for the day, really. But yeah, this is the room. So you've got, um, come through the door, you've got a hairdryer, which you didn't have in the other one. Um, and then in here is the bathroom. So it's kind of a, a wet room. Sink, toilet, shower, very simple. Oh, it doesn't have a, this bigger kind of situation to put makeup bags and wash bags and stuff but anyway this will do towels and stuff i haven't is that hand dryer oh no that's the toilet roll dispenser what the hell that's so weird no. oh no there we go and yeah so you've got somewhere to put your case here a little mirror hello nice wardrobe space oh got a bible up there spare pillows yes Aircon unit. Oh, that's brilliant. Nice, nice big desk area. So it's great. My stuff. And here's the beds. Two singles, which is great for me and mum. Two bedside tables, which the other place didn't have. What's the what's the view like? It's got blackout blinds, brilliant. Oh, <laughs> Someone out there with a cigarette. Okay, not great. But we didn't book this place for prettiness. We booked it for practicality. So, and also I've just tried the bed and it's so comfy. Oh, <laughs> it's such a comfy bed. I love it. I love it a lot. <laughs> so yeah, today we've just kind of had a wander around. It's been very hot today. Haven't really done much filming, to be quite honest with you. Yeah, it's been a bit hot again. <sighs> we did go into Primark though. And I did buy a few things. Should I show you now? I'll show you now. I might as well. I don't know how much of this you can get at home. But I bought a hat. Because it was hot. And also it has my friend on. I also bought this suitcase. <laughs> Mickey and Minnie with love. I have not seen this at all. I think I may have seen this on social media. It's a little cabin size one. And I bought a couple more things. In, which I put inside the case so I didn't have to have a bag as well. I look ridiculous. I look like I'm about here for like a month. <laughs> I'm here for a, like less than a week. Oh, I bought a swimming costume. All of this has got a Disney theme by the way. I'm really sorry if you don't like Disney, but I bought the Mickey Mouse swimming costume. I saw it and I was like, this is ridiculous. I need it in my life. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> oh, dearie D. But yeah, bought the swimming costume. And then I bought one more thing, which was a t-shirt. Again, a Disney t-shirt, but it's not Mickey and Minnie this time. It is Lilo and Stitch. And it's just got Lilo and Stitch and Ohana means family, which is really quite cute, isn't it? I am very happy with these purchases. <laughs> I did not need them at all, but I really wanted them. And I had some money to spend. So I went into Primark, which I could have done at home. But everything I bought, apart from the swimming costume, I haven't actually seen in the UK stores, which is kind of my excuse for this whole thing. And this, the hat was um, because I was hot and I needed a hat and Primark, Primark came through. <laughs> so yeah, I think tonight we're gonna go have, oops, hello. We're gonna have some food because it is 
quarter to quarter to nine at night. So I'm gonna have some food somewhere, don't know where. Hopefully somewhere's open. And then uh, I'm gonna go to bed. And tomorrow we're at Effling. I'm so excited.
So we just went on Villa Volta, which was that kind of mansion-y type one. So weird and so cool. I don't know how they do it. Basically, you're in like a chair and the room spins, but you also do that. I don't know. You don't go upside down though, but it's really good. Mum's now going to the toilet and we are um, going to go on the carousel, be all cute and all that. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know what else we're going to do, but having good, having good fun so far. It's only 12 o'clock, so been here about two hours. Well, just under, but yeah.
Chardonnay. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what to do. <laughs> into an enchanted water belly. Belgium 
and we've got a two hour and 15 minute car journey to a place called Eep. Now in Eep there's a lot of stuff with all the battlefields and things like that. So we're gonna be doing quite a lot of things like that. It's gonna be good, it's important that we do these things. And yeah, yesterday at Epling was amazing, so much fun. Mum and I were both so, so tired afterwards, but we had a good day, it was good. And yeah. Right now, I'm just finishing off getting ready, packing my case, there it is. And um, we're gonna be off, I'm gonna do my makeup in the car. And yeah. We've made it to Eep now. We're here. We're in our hotel. We're staying in the Novotel, I think it's called. It's a chain anyway. We're staying here. Well, I'd quickly show you our room. And we'll start from the door, shall we? This is this is our door. Lovely, lovely, lovely. <laughs> right. This is what you see as you come in. 
here you've got some nice hanging spaces you've got two so you've got one here and one over there this looks like a door to a connecting room but i don't want to open it in case i see someone in there this is a very tiny toilet how do you turn is there a light cool no just right okay great um oh do you have to put the card in somewhere mm. okay i'll work how to turn that on in a minute but here's the toilet then next door you've got bath sink hello there's me wonder if this light works no great love it and then here's our room you've got lots of like spaces to put things put stuff onto those are so here you've got a shoe shine sponge and you've got a little little sewing kit so teas and coffees which mum is very happy about as you can see she has already picked out that she is having all four coffees <laughs> um, kettle phone lamp tv nice double bed mum and i are going to be sharing this we've already found the extra pillows <laughs> And then it's also got a sofa bed, which can I'm assuming is a double bed, but I don't know. And we've got a lovely view. Should I show you it? How do I? How, where, where is the? Okay, maybe I go this way. Look at this. Look at this. How, how stunning. Oh, we've got got the church there. But yeah, how how stunning. <laughs> oh dear. But not not too bad. We're not having breakfast here either because. Do you know how much breakfast was? It was 20 euros per person. 20 euros per person. No. <laughs> per day, that is. Like, no, not happening. Anyway, I think for a little bit, we're gonna kind of chill out here because there's not much here in Eep to do. We have done a couple of like war things, First World War stuff. So we've done the trenches at Sanctuary Wood, Hill 62. Um, and we've also done a couple of cemeteries Essex Farm Cemetery and we uh, also at Essex Farm is a medical thing that was used I did have it I do know what it is you'd have seen it anyway by now um but yeah not sure what the plan is for the rest of the day you can see I went for a no makeup day today I no effort to put makeup on um but yeah I don't know what else we're doing you'll see as you as we continue the video.
that are left for all. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them.